Japan in terms of infrastructure, they put much effort on, for example, more having accessible facilities. And no, I, I visited Japan right before COVID-19 in 2019. And I actually was amazed about you know, how Japan actually transformed. You know, the Tokyo um, seems to be more uh, accessible. You know, there are new uh, um, infrastructure and such. So I think in terms of infrastructure, I think you know, there has been a lot of investment in it, and Japan has done a good job. But then there's also another aspect of attitude. You know, I, uh, Japanese people uh, open to people who has a, you know, um, for example, disabilities, a you know, person with disabilities. I think this more about attitude toward people who have a different attributes. Uh, I, I think Japan need to work further on that. Maybe Shoko, you, you may have a, a you know, a, a understanding on this because I think again, Japan is a homogeneous society and I think tendency of kind of exclude people who have a different background. So if even though there's a good infrastructure, it doesn't mean that Japan is inclusive or Japan is accepting. So, so I think my hope again was you know, Tokyo game could actually 